I've got to admit, guys, recently I've been uploading loads of videos about random, weird, and wacky UGC accessories. We've taken a look at funny stuff, knockoff limiteds, all types of random things that people have been uploading onto the UGC catalog. And today's video is no different, really. We've got more funny stuff to take a look at. Don't worry, though, guys, I do have more random content coming soon. But you guys have been asking me about the following accessories. So, yeah, let's get into it. The first one is the Cotton Tails Cheery Headgear. Now, this looks pretty weird. At first glance, it kind of looks like a rabbit blindfold or something. Well, it's actually a hat accessory, kind of like a helmet. And yeah, you guessed it. It's a rabbit Dominus. Nah, I'm just kidding. It's a rabbit Valk. It's a Valkyrie helm in the form of a bunny rabbit. So it's a bit weird, I've got to be honest. It's not too bad. However, the price isn't really that fair. I think 300 Robux is a bit expensive. They're kind of trying to like sell this thing as like an exclusive item. It goes off sale in what, a few hours or something? I don't really know what to feel about this though. It's not terrible, it's just not really that good. On people's avatars, it kind of looks like this. I guess we can try it inside of a game. Without a doubt, it's not the best UGC Valk we've taken a look at. However, I don't think it's too bad. If you get the right kind of avatar outfit, maybe it looks quite nice. The thing is, I tried to add this to like a boy's avatar and it really didn't work. So this is definitely one for the girls. I kind of want to see what happens if we wear like a regular Valk or something. I kind of want to see how it differs. So let me just find one. None are appearing. I might have to type in Red Velk or something. There you go. So if we compare the two here, the front part, that's fairly similar. It's just the wings at the back. Obviously, the bunny ears are a bit forward. Not terrible, though. They're kind of similar. By the looks of it, it's about to go off sale as well. But if you guys want it, I guess I'll link it down below. I wanted to briefly talk about this. I know I've been uploading a few Dominus videos recently. But look at this, right? Someone made a Minecraft Dominus. This was posted by RBLXUGC Moments. And yeah, this this is kind of insane. It's an 8-bit Dominus on Roblox. Kind of looks like a Minecraft character. And it appears they made it using around three accessories. So it's pretty much using the same method as my custom Dominus video from the other day. But this one is called the Derpy 303 Head. I really don't know why it's called that. I've been noticing a trend where quite a few UGC items are called Derpy. Like why? That's like such a cringe word. You know, I really hate that word actually. Apparently it is stolen from Minecraft, which is a bit of a shame, but there you go. On Minecraft, it's supposed to be like a ghoulish skin or something like that, or like a creepy ghost. Also, I was trying to find the parts to build it into a Dominus, and I think they've been archived. So I think they've pretty much been removed. So unfortunately, we won't be able to try it inside of a game, but a few people did. RBX News, they tried it earlier, and this is what it looks like. So it's not the worst Dominus I've ever seen. I do kind of like it in a way. It's just a shame it's copied, I guess. On the subject of DIY Dominus hats, apparently this guy made his own as well. This was sent to me by Azzy. This UGC creator has made his own Dominus. So he's called Raz and he made like a chicken Dominus or something or an eagle Dominus. Maybe we should take a closer look. Okay, I found it. I had to type in the guy's name to get this. So yeah, it turns out the hood thing's off sale. Let's have a look. The cape's on sale. So that's like one part of it. The horns, they were on sale as well. So I guess we're going to wear this. We're going to see how it looks. And that is not terrible. Yeah, I think it is an eagle actually. I really don't know if Roblox will delete this or not. They probably won't bother. But yeah, there you go. The Eagle Dominus. You know what? I kind of like that. That's really smart. I saw a post about this on Twitter. I thought this was interesting. So what this is, guys, is a recreation of an existing Roblox Limited, but an 8-bit format. This idea is not really something new because Roblox used to do this anyway. As we can see, we've got the blue 8-bit antlers, the 8-bit dark horns of Ponage, the 8-bit Viking, the 8-bit eyeball. There's like regular versions of these hats. So honestly, if Roblox made that thing, it would probably go limited. I really don't know if this thing is going to go on sale or not, but it's pretty much a copy of the Night Vision goggles selling for 444,000 Robux. It's a very rare item. There is actually an identical cheap version to be fair. That's called the Profit goggles, only 4,000. But yeah, like I was saying, this thing works the same. It's literally just the 8-bit version, which is interesting. So there we are. That's everything for this quick video. If you enjoyed it, leave a like, subscribe. Cheers for watching, guys. I will see you in the next one.